At the end of The Force Awakens, we saw Finn and Rey take on the dreaded Kylo Ren, although he was more Ben Solo than Kylo Ren at this point, just minutes after Ben took the life of his own father, Han Solo. <laughs> The fight resulted in two characters on the floor close to death, while one stood victorious. Rey stood above Kylo Ren, having successfully defeated him in their duel. Kylo Ren lay on the floor, looking up at this girl with no apparent training in the Force, who had just beaten him. Finn lay unconscious, and we as an audience don't know if he's going to make it alive. But what if the end of the movie didn't go down like this? What if Rey wasn't the victor, and Kylo Ren was? What would happen? Will Rey die? Let's find out. After many swings, slices, parries and dodges, the epic fight of Kylo Ren vs Rey is coming to a close. The two end up face to face looking at each other and pouring their emotions into each other through the gap of their lightsabers. Red and blue light creates the colour of purple on their faces. Kylo Ren shouts in Rey's face, You need a teacher, he says. Let me show you the ways of the Force. Rey stood there, looking into Kylo Ren's eyes, frozen. The Force. Rey knew what the Force was. She felt it. She couldn't remember how or why she knew about this, but she knew. The Force, she said. She thought about what Kylo Ren offered her. You need a teacher. Rey considered Kylo Ren's offer. Maybe this is what Rey needs. Kylo Ren is powerful. The First Order are powerful. Rey could do whatever she wanted with that kind of power. No more starving, no more portions. She could finally find her family with the help of the First Order. She could explore the Force, learn more, find Luke Skywalker. Rey snapped out of it. No. She couldn't join the First Order. She couldn't join Kylo Ren. Rey didn't know much about Kylo or even the First Order, but she knew what they've done. She knew what they were going to do. She looked into the eyes of Kylo Ren. She felt cold, scared, and she knew that this could be it. She looked over to Finn, who was lying on the floor, either unconscious or dead. Her face changed. A single tear came out of her eye. She looked into the eyes of Kylo Ren once more, who was already staring into her eyes intensely pain behind his eyes. Join me, he shouted. Rey had made her choice. Rey looked Kylo Ren into the eyes and said, never. Rey headbutts Kylo Ren, which causes him to take a few steps back, grabbing his now broken nose with one hand. He looks at Rey and lowers his hand to reveal his bloody nose. So be it. Kylo Ren lunged at Rey, attacking her from every angle with his fiery crossguard lightsaber. Rey parries and dodges a couple of the shots, but it was getting too much. Rey couldn't hold it any longer. Ren lets out a series of ferocious downward two-handed strikes on Rey, causing Rey to fall to one knee. Kylo Ren finally hits Rey with a strike that was too much. He hit Rey's saber down and then hit it from the side causing the glowing blue blade of Luke Skywalker's lightsaber to fly in the air and land 10 meters away from the clutches of Kylo Ren and Rey. Rey glances at the old lightsaber hilt buried in the snow, the blade retracted. She looks back up to Kylo Ren who stands above her, his red lightsaber in one hand, blood pouring from his nose. The supreme leader would have rewarded me for recruiting such a young, talented force wielder. To think you almost had me. Kylo Ren deactivates his bursting blades and clips his hilt onto his belt. Vader's lightsaber still has one more Jedi to kill in it. Ren proclaims, Goodbye, Rey. Kylo Ren thrusts one hand in the air in the direction of the former lightsaber of Luke and Anakin Skywalker, trying to pull it into his hands by using the Force. Rey sees the silver hilt wiggle and shake on the floor to then finally whip in the air. It lunges in the direction of Kylo Ren but shoots right past him. The lightsaber lands in another's hand. Alright guys, that is the end of part one of potentially a three part series, like a short story series. In this case we're talking about what would happen if Rey lost the duel between her and Kylo Ren. And I'm really looking forward to writing part two and part three or maybe in part four, I don't know. It's going to be a short story series, I'm going to do a lot more of these. And I really love exploring these hypothetical situations where I really use my creativity and my writing and deliver great quality videos for you guys. So if you enjoyed them please be sure to let me know in the comments down below. Whose hand will that lightsaber end up in and what's going to happen next? Let me know your thoughts down below. This took a long time to do guys so I'd really appreciate a huge like on this video if you enjoyed, that extremely helps me out. If you enjoyed this video and want to show your friends, then please give this video a share. Subscribe to me to see what happens next and for more Star Wars videos. Thanks for watching guys, see you very soon.